Uh, good morning, almost 442. Still waters run deep. By the way, the depth of the inner harbor about right there is 56 feet, in case anybody's curious. Uh, look at the reflection of the cityscape lights in the inner harbor. Just winds almost dead calm. Look at the promenade, lower left-hand side of your screen. Unlike yesterday, it is dry. And we start what is going to be another nice day on a pretty darn calm note. 42 degrees in Jarrisville. It is 40 in Westminster, 42 Elegant City. 41 Columbia right now, 42 uh, Glen Burnie. Again, TV Hill in the mid-40s. Rock Hall, good morning. You're at 39 as we move through the day. A generous amount of sunshine, and not unlike yesterday in the heat of the afternoon, we'll get up to a high of about 60 degrees, officially 57, 58. I think by noon that gets bumped up to 60 as it did yesterday. Point is, all these, the, the, the high temperature should actually be about 46 degrees, so we're trending well above average. You've got a, got a heat pump high down over the Gulf of Mexico. Now, it is gathering some moisture, and a frontal boundary moving across the country is going to drag that moisture our way. Let's go ahead and time it out for you on the future cast. Keep your eye on the time stamp. We'll start to see some clouds come in. The light clouds come in a little bit later on this afternoon and tonight. Then the first time we'll really see moisture coming our way will be very, very early tomorrow morning. So the question is, Will we during the commute tomorrow have a lot of shower activity or just some annoying rain? Either way, it's going to play into Christie's reporting. Then that clears out rather quickly. And behind it, we still don't see a big chunk of cold moving our way. As we discussed yesterday, it's going to stay relatively mild as we move through the seven day, which we'll show you in a second. Overnight tonight, certainly mild, uh, about five or six degrees above average in the low 40s. Christy Breslin, good morning. Let's check out that first alert traffic. Take it away.